Welcome back. There is now a second Black Lives Matter mural in downtown Springfield. The new mural was completed earlier today on the side of a building. As 22 News reporter Cy Becker found out, this second mural ties in with a dispute over the vandalism to the mural completed last month near City Hall. The volunteer team of neighborhood residents worked on their Black Lives Matter mural for several hours Saturday morning. Their canvas, the side of a building on Worthington Street in the heart of the downtown entertainment district. The first mural on Court Street has been plagued on several occasions by tire-related damage. City Councilor Tracy Whitfield, who also spearheaded this newest mural, coupled this project with some strong words. Why is because the defacing of the mural on Court Street has happened three times. The administration has not publicly come out and identified um, the first person who defaced the mural and they do know who that person is. So the mayor, the commissioner, they know. Some of Saturday's volunteer artists also had a hand in the painting of the Court Street mural. They went at this latest project with a sense of purpose and enthusiasm. Creatives that come from the, from the community. Um, I think it's a big statement, um, very important, and I'm happy to be here. Saturday's mural and the Court Square Black Lives Matter artistic statement are both predated by the mural completed during the summer at the Martin Luther King Jr. Community Center building on Rutland Street. A mural listing the names of men of color who had died at the hands of police over the previous period of 12 months. Working for you in Springfield, Cy Becker, 22.